Yes, thank you so much our moderator. Talking about university politics, I have always have had a problem with our politics we play in university. In any case, we shouldn't be calling them politics. I think the reason why we need leaders at university is to champion student welfare, but not to engage in partisan politics. And once we engage in partisan politics, this means we are coming up with what we call political sensationalism. People are just going to get emotional simply because someone subscribed to this party, to the other party, and at the end, we forget the real goal that we should be champions or we should be championing students' welfare. Now, the problem I have with this model of uh, guild elections and everything that happens within university, it's not in the interest of the students. And once we have that one, then we don't have leadership. When you consider university, we should be having services, but go to the halls of residence. They are rotten. They are stinking. Go to lecture rooms. You will find boards that even a lecturer cannot write on. That means we have migrated from being champions of students' welfare into something we have degenerated into something what I can call national politics. People are just making themselves available for future appointments. You find when you are at university, you know the best way to join mainstream politics you be active, you identify yourself to a certain party, then maybe some big don in government may have sympathy on you and finally uproots you from the university. Then you join the mainstream politics. But that is, that is something we shouldn't be doing. What we need is a leader, a guild leader, who is going to identify the students of Makerere University, pay this money and they have a right to access service A, B, and C. If that person cannot identify that at university his cardinal responsibility is to liaise with university administration, minister of education, and make sure that the services are available to keep Makere up on the note of other global universities, then we are not having leaders. So our moderator, I'm so disappointed with this campaign, you know, get the elections and everything. It's just a sham. We should be planning on how to bring back the norms of being champions of students' welfare, but not engaging in excitement because you need to be appointed A, B, and C. Because you need it to be seen that in the future you can have a profile and tell people that you know what, I have ever been a leader, I was at Makere, I did A, B, and C. No, what we need are students' welfare being fulfilled. Do the promises you make when you want to be a good president, are you in capability of doing them? Or you are just showing someone that I'm also present? So that's what I can expound on that one, our moderator. Thank you.